The story of the legendary monster of Cudgel War Lake. A tale by Herr Egil Drakhuvud, Squire to Sir Brendan. Narrated by Jarl Peregrin. Illustrated and inscribed by Aslin O'Fallon. The truth of this story was witnessed by many, including the Queen of Dragonborn and the Princess of Nordmark. So it must be true. Once upon a time, there was a monster in the lake. It had eaten children for several years. But when it bit a child in the foot this year, a mighty warrior stepped up declaring that he would slay the monster. First, he dove into the lake and started to dig the monster out of its lair with his bare hands. The monster did not yield and neither did our warrior. He brought strong rope and many lords and ladies down for a second attempt. This warrior is from Frostheim. They are not the kind of people to ever give up. He dove down into the muddy water and found the monster again. He put several loops around its neck and the whole crowd tried to strangle the monster. But the monster did not yield. And being from frost time, neither did our fierce warrior. Even though at this point, people had told him to give up. An old and rusty saw was brought to him and this time he went down and stayed under for a long time. Then he broke the surface with the monster's head in his fist. He yelled, Behold the monster's head! The lake is safe for us again! Even though the monster was dead, its eyes were terrible to behold. So, with a knife, our warrior picked them out and replaced them with two fine carnelian gems from Nordmark. The monster's head was later presented to the Baron and Baroness of Arnemetza as a gift. And the moral of the story is that sometimes you just have to keep on trying, and you'll find a way to achieve your goal. The end.